Lifestyle TV's television series titled Media Focus touches on a subject that has been affecting the Chinese Canadian community, anti-Asian racism. The ongoing COVID experience contributed to a social environment that witnessed an increase in racism. 相信對方係誠實正直，可以信賴。信任被認為係一種依賴關係，值得信任嘅個人或者團體就要實踐政策上或者道德守則、法律上以及有關嘅承諾。新冠肺炎肆虐全球超過一年，約克大學社會學系嘅吳志明教授舊年就獲得政府資助，針對疫情進行調查研究，就係、是、要探討疫情底下三種信任。Mona Awood, Omni Television Arabic edition, reports on an Afghan refugee claimant living in Toronto, and while under the threat of the Taliban, asking why the Canadian government has not included his family currently in Afghanistan, not in Canada's evacuation list. That the Canadian system is broken. People are literally going to die because of the Canadian bureaucracy. And for me as a Canadian, that's just not acceptable. على الرغم من أن الحكومة الكندية قد وعدت بإخلاء من عمل بشكل مباشر مع بعثتها العسكرية في أفغانستان وإعادة توطين عشرين ألف أفغاني نظرا لتدهور الأوضاع. And the moment of truth. Here we go. Red envelope. I'm trying to do this as gracefully as possible, and it's not happening. Apology. Here we go. The winner is. Stephen So, Fairchild TV for three kinds of trust. Congratulations. 佢哋嘅網站喺過去一年轉載咗好多唔同媒體對呢項研究嘅報導，亦都發表咗好多研究，不斷喺度更新資料，仲有各種連接帶到佢所發表過嘅研究報告或者媒體嘅新聞報導，呈現初步研究成果同數據。我們研究一個關鍵點，就是說，誒，為什麼？在这个疫情里面，全世界范围内对亚洲人、对中国人有大规模的攻击啊，反中国人啊，然后呢，把这个病毒说是呃 China virus， 就是中国病毒啊，或者武汉病毒。Oh, thank you so much for this amazing award tonight. Thank you all of you. Hi, greetings from Fairchild TV. My name is Steve So. I'm the writer and producer for the weekly programs. Media focus of Fairchild Television and my country, my home of television. I would like to sincerely thank the Canadian Ethnic Media Association for this honor. Thanks to their great efforts, this meaningful event became popular and so well received with profound implications. During this unprecedented time in history, COVID-19 becomes the focus of daily news. Our episode of Three Kinds of Trust Under Pandemic wants to raise awareness about racism, discrimination, and violence against Asians due to increasing stigma and misunderstanding. To build and restore the mutual trust in our society, the message of this episode is to maintain our precious harmony and acceptance. This is also the powerful heritage and ideology of being Canadian that we respect in ourselves and in each other. We must work together collectively. Above all, I thank my crew for their endeavors and tireless efforts. I am honored as a part of this incredible team. Once again, thank you so much to everyone at the CIMA. It's a privilege for our team to be recognized on this stage. Thank you, and enjoy the rest of the night. Congratulations to everyone who submitted their work in the television category. You certainly did not make the job easy for the judges to decide. Now let's head on over to Edmonton, Alberta, where Jesse is standing by to announce the winner of the radio category.